a man who had suffered a stroke approximately six months ago, has come to the outpatients. Good morning, Mr. Doyle. My name is Nurse Ryan. I see from your notes that you've suffered a stroke a few months ago. Is that right? Yes, in March of this year. This morning, we're going to have a quick chat and ask you a few questions to see how you're doing moving around and how steady on your feet you are. Is that okay? Yes, that's fine. Have you had any fall since your stroke, Mr. Doyle? Yes, I had a little fall in the bathroom about three weeks ago. So, what happened? I was getting up off the toilet and just lost my balance. I fell on the floor. My wife got our next door neighbor, Jack, in to help me get up. I was very lucky as I didn't hurt myself, so I didn't need to go to the doctor or hospital. Has the occupational therapist visited you home? No, not yet. Okay. I purchased a raised toilet seat since the fall, and it has really helped me when I am getting up off the toilet. That's great. So you haven't fallen since? No. So you're able to use the toilet on your own? Yes, I've been more careful when going to the toilet now. How is your eyesight since your stroke? I am fine once I remember to put on my glasses. Okay, Mr. Doyle, if you could please stand up. I'll give it a go. I sometimes find it difficult to get up off the chair, and my wife usually gives me a hand. Okay, Mr. Doyle, hold on. I'll give you a hand. Thank you, nurse. Okay, I'm up. Now, Mr. Doyle, can you please walk to the door, turn around, and come back to the seat, please? With my walker? Do you think you could do without it? No, I don't think I could do this. Sorry. Then by all means, please use the walker. Well done, Mr. Doyle. Now please take a seat. Thank you. That's great, Mr. Doyle. After assessing your mobility, I'm going to make a referral to the occupational therapist to come out and visit your home. In the meantime, I'm going to give you this leaflet with information on how to prevent falls. It also includes tips on how to help make your house safe. For example, loose rugs, poor lighting. Thank you so much, nurse. You're very welcome, Mr. Doyle. Bye-bye. Goodbye, Mr. Doyle.